What's up, Bird Gang? It's your boy, the Black Hawk Rex. And I know I'm a little late to this, but I want to give my own personal thoughts and opinions about the new tactical first person shooter game, Frag Punk. Now, I've been blessed to have the opportunity to have played the beta version. And I must say, the game has a lot to unpack from the characters' abilities to many different game modes. But first, let's talk about the characters. The characters are called Lancers, and each Lancer has special abilities that they can use in game. Next, you have shark cards. Shark cards are also special abilities that you can use in game. Certain shark cards are only used in specific game modes, though. Next, we have the many different game modes, starting with Shard Clash. Shard Clash is like Valorant. You have the standard version and you have the ranked. Next, you have Team Deathmatch, self explanatory. Capture the Core, which is more like Capture the Flag. Scrimmage Mode, which is a free for all and Dual Master, which is 1v1s. Now I want to talk about my personal thoughts and opinions about Frag Punk. The good, the bad, and the ugly. Now let's start with the bad. Number one, there's zero weapon customization in this game. Now that might be because they want to even out the playing field, but in my opinion, some weapons recoil and handling could be a lot better. Secondly, I wish the game had input-based matchmaking. Now to be fair, they do allow you to switch your inputs in game, so if you're dying to a roller demon, you can just pick up a controller in game and continue to play. And lastly, the lack of weapon selection. At the moment, Frag Punk only offers about 2 assaults, 2 SMGs, 2 shotguns, 2 DMRs, 1 sniper, and about 4 to 8 handguns depending on the game that you're playing. Now I'm hoping that they do switch this later on in the game. But if not, I mean, it is what it is, right? So let's move on to the ugly. I don't have the footage to show this, but there's been times where I've dealt damage of over 150 to an opponent, and the opponent still lives for some whatever reason. And secondly, getting shot around corners. I don't know if it's a ping issue, but I know it's happened quite a few times, and I know that when it does happen, it's quite annoying. Now, with all that being said, there's so many good things about Frag Punk that I really love, I don't even know where to begin. But for starters, I love the fact that in between matches, you have the opportunity to stay ready and warmed up by jumping into scrimmage, 1v1s, or the firing range while the game is looking for a match to put you in. I think that's really unique and dope. Now, you can also create your own custom match or you can join somebody else's custom match without even having to use a code. Another feature that caught my attention is their firing range. It offers the most unique ways to improve your gameplay by offering different types of targets and situations to help improve your aim. This can almost replace your aim training, almost. Now, another thing that I believe is noteworthy about Frag Punk is at the end of every match, you can look at the combat data, lancer data, and the weapon data of your opponents and your own teammates. This will allow you to know what type of lances were being used, what type of abilities were being used, your opponent's hit percentages, what type of weapon your opponents were using as well. I think this is pretty good to pretty much gain solid information on how to change your game style as well. All right, guys, so that's all my thoughts and opinions about Frag Punk. Let me know in the comments your thoughts if you had a chance to play test this game. But in my opinion, I'd give this game a solid 8.5 out of 10. If only they would add just a little bit more weapons, maybe fix the latency and add weapon customization, this game would be a solid 10 out of 10. But for what it's worth and what I played, it's an amazing game. And I'm looking forward for it to be releasing sometime next year. But in the comments, let me know if you play if you also play test this game. What are your thoughts on this game? And if you're looking forward to playing this game drop that in the comments as well but until next time take care of yourselves spread love sniper. and peace Careful. and i'm out of here deuces